Today I got you guys 10 worst juggernaut spots or locations and this may get you triggered. It is very important you understand what I'm about to say next, alright? Trust me, when I was making this list, I felt that triggerness coming. I was just like, shit, but I told myself I gotta keep on going. That was my, uh, a tap to my heart right there, just so you know what I'm saying. A lot of you guys wouldn't care about my feelings here, but what I'm trying to say here is that I felt that triggerness coming. And I'm a huge follower of keeping up during the darkest of time. I'm sure you know what I'm saying, but ladies and gentlemen, have a helmet or pot on top of your head. It can definitely prevent you from high temperatures, from getting triggered midway through the video. It will also keep your hygiene up, believe it or not, and it is highly advised you put it on while watching this video. I personally have it on while I'm recording this, and you guys can cheat because I want to stay safe. You know what I'm saying, right? But real quick, if you're new to the channel, hey, make sure to subscribe and let me know in the comments so I can feature you in my next video. But coming in at our number 10 spot, ladies and gentlemen, I'm talking about a lot of people's favorite map, aka Barry, and we're going to annihilate the shit out of it. A lot of people like this map, and I I want to say it is complete garbage or I mean to say the juggernaut location is complete garbage let's say if you're playing with Bob or Bobby and Tony my mind about Tony right if you're playing with them hey guess what Tony is a serious player hashtag new series coming very soon so yeah Tony have the paralyzer and guess what you're on round 50 okay you got this long as hallway first of all you gotta visit my boy Arthur you gotta get those keys very important release my boy Arthur get that booze and trust me this is like clickbait 101 right it's like Treyarch and clickbait right in a nutshell now let me explain so as soon as you get that boost Arthur will be attracted to you of course you got that boost aka you're clickbaiting you're exploiting all the laws of like whatever it doesn't matter it doesn't matter right you're you have that you're clickbaiting and guess what seconds later you're gonna let my boy Arthur drink that shit and as soon as he drinks that shit he will go bozo he will destroy it and he will wreck that shit and pew pew uh, you will see that long ass hove it's very long long but at the same time it's tighter it's, I'm getting off topic right here but ladies and gentlemen Barry they got a long ass hallway and as soon as you go inside here and if you're on round 50 and you went down midway through the round and you want to buy juggernaut once again of course you're gonna come in here and guess what there will be a lot of zombies Bob will be already down Bobby will be dead as well and you know all of that but at the same time you will try to act stupid and you will try to go buy juggernaut making sure you can buy juggernaut and get your ass out of here but surprise surprise there will be a huge train of zombies and you will go down and it's not a good meme though but coming in at our number nine spot ladies and gentlemen i'm talking about a beautiful meme by the name of the eyes on the now the eyes on the it's all up in here all in the heart it's one of my favorite maps. but at the same time this map has one of the worst location for juggernaut it's not really intense compared to other maps but at the same time it's still there like let's say you have went down on round 12 or it doesn't matter it doesn't matter right let's say you have went down on round 50 there's panzer on your ass most of the time you go down because of Papa Panzer, right? Like the map is easy AF, but you need Juggernaut or you need to buy Juggernaut because hey, Tony is not around, uh, Bob is already dead. Uh, of course, you gotta buy Juggernaut to survive and get you that round 100. So you will try and go buy Juggernaut. And when you go there, there will be zombies in front of you, to the right of you, to the left, behind you. Papa Panzer will be already there and you will buy Juggernaut and guess what? You're gonna get slap on your BS and you will go down. But coming in at our number 8 spot, ladies and gentlemen, we're talking about Call of the Dead. Now, Call of the Dead, of course, it's all up in here. It's one of my favorite map once again, but you need to go through that water in order to get Juggernaut. And believe it or not, water is not wet. If somehow you get wet, don't blame my neighbor water, alright? You hear me? Don't blame water. Water is not wet. And also, in Call of the Dead, you get frozen water, which is a little different from uh, uh, from my neighbor water. But at the same time, it is not wet, though. So, uh, in order to buy Juggernaut on Call of the Dead, you gotta open a bunch of doors. Doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. You gotta open a bunch of doors, alright? You gotta go through that water, and most of the times, if you're smart, if you're a smart zombie player, which I'm assuming you are, I'm not gonna try to trigger you here, but I I'm assuming you are, I I'm sure you are a smart zombies player, right? So you will leave one zombie alive, and hey, guess what? That zombie will be following your ass, you will go through that water, and he will try to make it through, but he will be uh, frozen to death. Ladies and gentlemen, that will end the round, and guess what? You will buy Juggernaut, and seconds later, zombies will be spawning in. Next thing you know, George Romero is right behind you, or right next to you, or right in front, doesn't matter, he will be around where you need to be, but hey, 
what I'm trying to say, it's not really a good meme. But ladies and gentlemen, coming in at our number 7 spot, we're talking about Kino Der Toten, which is one of my favorite, if not my favorite map. This was my first map that I ever played in this thing called Call of Duty Black Ops Zombies, and it's my favorite map. I don't care if your favorite map is Origins, Mob of the Dead, doesn't matter, doesn't matter. My favorite map is Kino Der Toten, but at the same time, it has one of the worst Juggernaut location. It's not intense compared to other ones that I will have on the list like later on in the video But at the same time it is a little too intense if you know what I mean But at the same time, you know what I'm saying So the thing is you go down on round 50 It's mid round and the next thing you check is your wonder weapon by the name of thunder gun, right? And hey surprise surprise it ain't got no ammo and the next thing you want is my boy juggernaut So you will buy juggernaut you will look around and guess what there there are a bunch of Nova crawlers, there are a bunch of zombies. You will try to go for the headshot, but the next thing you know, Nova crawler got your ass. And Bob will be looking at you, will be saying like, what? Well, you're more Bob than me, boy. But coming in at our number six spot, we're talking about Shino Numa. Now, Shino Numa is crazy. It's a classic on top, but at the same time, what I'm trying to say here is that it got a lot of that randomness factor, which can be cool, right? Like, we need that in zombies, but at the same time, we don't need too much of it. And the next map I got on the list got plenty of it. Like, shit's crazy, but hey, we're talking about Shino Numa, and I get distracted quite a lot. I'm not sure if you guys get distracted distracted when you're talking about something but I mean to say like Shino Numa has that randomness factor and the thing is sometimes or 9 out of 10 times it happens where you will go around by the doors and guess what you will end up buying all the doors in order to find Juggernaut so in that regard Shino Numa has one of the worst Juggernaut location or more sort of like hassle spot if you know what I mean right but coming in at our number 5 spot ladies and gentlemen we're talking about the granddaddy or the big papa of Shino Numa it's known by Nuketown now Nuketown Town is crazy. Sometimes Juggernaut can spawn on round 7. Even that is considered like a high round because the two hit system is crazy and the map is tighter than the bum hole for sure. It's so tight, right? It's probably the tightest. I'm not even sure if that's a word or not, but uh, you know what I'm saying, right? Like two hit, you're dead, bro. You're dead. Sometimes Juggernaut can spawn on round 7, sometimes on round 10, 15, 20, even 25. Shit's crazy and I swear to god, Nuketown is one of my favorite map. I love this map. But Treyarch, why you do this, bro? But coming in at our number four spot, ladies and gentlemen, a lot of people favorite map Origins. Now, Origins is crazy. We're talking about the normal one, we're talking about Origins Remaster, we're also talking about the Panzer, we're also talking about the Panzer Remaster, and shit is crazy AF. Now, if you're like Tony, Tony is my boy who's a serious or pro player. He's very serious, basically. Every time he plays, he's all about like uh, doing Easter eggs, right? So that's just a glimpse of uh, my upcoming series so just trying to say like my neighbor Tony will be there but uh, if you're like Tony most of the times you're gonna go down the cause will be a big because Papa Pens are spawned in and he actually shot or he it doesn't matter it doesn't matter right he actually got you down that's what I'm trying to say so you have went down because of Papa Panzer the next thing you know you don't have generator for active so you will try to activate that generator once again and what you're gonna do you're most likely gonna train all the zombies you will do a giant S circle all around the map and you will finally make it to generator number four and guess what uh, you will start or you will initiate that process of like activating that generator number four Papa Panzer he will be right on top of your head and guess what you somehow will be able to make it through you will activate that shit but you will be red screen and so you will actually make sure you make another circle and somehow you will succeed you will make another circle you will get back in here you will go by juggernaut you will turn around and as scared as I was when I was actually doing that like years ago you will be the same as well and guess what panzer will be right behind you zombies will be there shit's crazy and it's not a good meme but coming in at our number three spot ladies and gentlemen we're talking about shangri la and shangri la is crazy a lot of people like this map a lot of people love this map and a lot of people hate this map i personally don't like this map but at the same time i don't hate it either i feel like it's a good meme but at the same time it's like juggernaut spot is crazy all right it's a tedious spot or right? i gotta say sometimes it's a lot of hassle to find juggernaut location because sometimes it happens that you open this 
this door, you will try to make sure Juggernaut is there, and the next thing you know, boy oh boy, it's not spawned there. So what you will do, you will go back there, alright, where the remaster mud is, right? You will go there, you will open that door, and surprise, surprise, you will actually jump on that thing, and those little pingy type of shit, they won't spawn in. You know what I'm saying, right? They won't spawn in, so guess what? You're gonna be walking in that mud, and the mud will make you slower, right? You will be walking, and surprise, surprise, zombies will be right behind you, he will be running, and uh, that's uh, that's Treyarch for you, right? And luckily, you will make your way through, but guess what? You will be red screen because that zombie has slapped you two times. And if you were playing on Black Ops 1 and somehow you got slapped two times, you will be dead. EF. But coming in at our number two spot, ladies and gentlemen, I'm talking about the worst zombies map ever in the history of this thing called Call of Duty Zombies. Now, to a lot of people, this is probably the worst zombies map, and some people embrace it like they have never embraced anything before. But at the same time, the map isn't like uh, I enjoy it sometimes to time whenever I play this map. So I'm not trying to bash this map, but at the same time, I'm trying to bash this map if you know what I'm saying, right? But at the same time, what I'm trying to say here is that uh, it's not the reason why I have this on the list. Like, Zetsubu Shima being the worst zombies map is not the reason why I have this on the list But that is the reason why I have this on the list. You know what I'm saying, right? But uh, we're talking about its juggernaut location and that's when Shima, my goodness It's just a quality ass meme now first of all you got to turn on the power in order to do that You got to water two generators not one but two generators one is on the left hand side of the map And the second one is of course right hand side of the map and shit's crazy as soon as you water those generators you want to come up in the middle you will open this door and boy oh boy the next thing you know thrasher yes he will spawn in thrashers will be here all right and you'll be like shit's easy shit's crazy i got juggernaut but hey we're not over yet so what you want to do is you want to go straight forward right you want to go to your left and hey there will be a door you gotta buy and guess what as soon as you buy that as soon as you uh purchase that with your hard-earned cash right you gotta go straight up you gotta go underwater that's right you gotta go underwater you gotta clear that spider goddamn web you're you're gonna do that yes we're playing this thing called call of duty zombies right so you're gonna do it zombies will spawn in you will fight okay one zombie okay he gone two zombie okay he gone to no 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 there will be 20 zombies right there will be 20 ass zombies okay i'm uh, exaggerating maybe there will be like 10 but what i'm trying to say there will be zombies so you will try to get rid of them pew pew that nibba's gone pew pew that nibba's gone too so you'll go out and there will be a power switch and hey surprise surprise nine out of ten times there will be zombie right in front of you and hey he will slap you two goddamn times to make sure you got a red screen so you panic and shit right so you will go around you'll make another circle you'll make sure you actually have heal yourself entirely you'll go around turn on the power go back and then you'll be able to buy juggernaut and hey it's not a good meme i swear this time i will say that for sure it's not a good meme but coming in at our number one spot we're talking about this thing called moon and moon or moon remaster same shit and shit is crazy af now First of all, you will make sure Juggernaut spawn as soon as you actually spawn on the map on this thing called Area 51. So you will make sure there is no speed cola. You will restart the shit out of that map just so you can actually see that beautiful Juggernaut, right? You will grind for points so you can actually buy that perk. And as soon as you buy that perk, you will teleport yourself on the moon. And the next thing you know, you are on round 50. Yeah, yeah, you, totally you. You made it, bro. Like, you made it. You're on round 50. All right, ne the next thing you know, you went down. Yeah, sh it should happen sometimes. You went down. You'll teleport yourself back hoping you can actually get Juggernaut once again I'm not talking about like using Gobble Gums. I'm pretty sure there will be one guy. Hey schedule You can use Parkaholic. Yeah, you can use it But uh, this video is about like Juggernaut locations or 10 worst Juggernaut locations, right? And this takes the cake. So you will teleport back and surprise surprise there will be no Juggernaut and you will be left in the dust and uh, Hey, you would have to teleport on the moon once again and then you will have to teleport once again on area 51 in order to buy juggernaut and shit is crazy af and i swear if, if you haven't watched any of the videos that you see on the screen uh check them out they are very good as well <laughs> uh, smash a like if you did enjoy this video subscribe if you're new and let me know in the comments right now what is the worst location in your opinion and what is the best map for a juggernaut location let me know that in the comments right now and i'll see you very freaking soon